Hi, this is a quick tip video on the uh, on the new update. Not super new. It actually came out a little while ago. I just I've been meaning to do a video on it, but I haven't. Uh, you know, if you get lucky enough to get a bind and fly plane that has the uh, more recent update on the firmware, it started with 2.46.1, I believe. Anything past that, you no longer have to have the USB programmer to unlock it and uh, reprogram it if you want, if you choose to do so. Uh, used to be where you had to get the USB programmer, put new firmware on it. I've got a bunch of videos on that, but if you get lucky enough to get the new one, uh, if you have this new option on your forward programming, when you and then this happens to be on a Radio Master TX16S, but it's the same menu if you have a Spectrum transmitter. But if you see this option, see right now all you have is the gyro settings, you can't do much. If you go into the Show Advanced Menus and you enable that, or activate it, you now have an other settings option. From there, you can adjust your fail-safe settings. From here, you can do a factory reset of your of your receiver. So uh, now just keep in mind, when you do this, it will have no gyro functions until you go through and do all the first time setup. That part of it is gonna be the same as my previous videos where you go through and do the first time setup and then the first time safe setup and configure all that and reset all your channels and everything. So. Uh, but it is nice that you no longer have to have the uh, USB programmer, so it'll save you a few steps on setting up your plane if you want to get in and do some customization. Just wanted to share that with you. Uh, any questions, put them in the comments below. Uh, but uh, it's nice of them to do this and save us the hassle of uh, going jumping through all their hoops to unlock it. Uh, thanks for watching.